Um, so that's called the photonic fence, and basically the idea is to find mosquitoes flying around in the sky and shoot them down with laser beams. Um, sounds like science fiction. It sounds like science fiction, and we were kind of joking around when we first tossed the idea around, but um, as we thought about it, we realized uh, we should be able to do it, and um, people thought that we couldn't, and that made us want to try. So, um, so we built this thing, and it works. And uh, what we can do is um, we use a CMOS sensor like you'd find in a webcam or something that looks for, I mean, that just collects video, but then what we do is we use motion detection algorithms running on a GPU to um, find moving stuff in the video. Anything that's moving, we use a laser galvo to aim a laser at it. From that, we get a wing beat frequency that we detect either in the CMOS sensor or in a like a just a photodiode. And then from that signal, we can tell uh, from the wing beat frequency, hey, this is you know a bug. It's a mosquito. It's an Ophelis defensi, which is the species we're going after that carries malaria, and it's female. You know, any variation on those things would give us a different wing beat signature, even a male mosquito. So uh, that gives us enough data to decide that this is a valid target. And then we fire a lethal laser at it and shoot it down. And uh, it's deeply satisfying work because everyone hates mosquitoes. It takes us about 30 milliseconds to identify a mosquito. Um, and then, you know, depending on how big a laser we use, we can kill them. Uh, you know, really fast with a giant laser, or what we are more likely to do is use a low-powered um, diode laser that gives us the ability to maybe track them and dose them over 100 milliseconds or so. One of these systems could probably kill 10 mosquitoes in a second. So with a pesticide, what's happening is you're just spraying chemicals that kill all the bugs. They don't care which kind of bugs. <laughs> you know, um, you kill everything. And in our case, what's cool about this is that we're computing the value of the life of every individual bug before we kill it. And so we're, we're highly discriminate, you know, and that's been an unprecedented capability for humans. We've never, never been able to do that before. And now we can afford to deploy the computational capacity to do that. And, uh, that's exciting stuff. You know, we can, you know, we're doing that for malaria. We'll be able to do it for crops and, um, and keep from having to use so many chemicals, hopefully.